Hey guys. hey guys, I'm Ariel. I'm Sierra. Welcome back to Snacks and Chill. So today we have Burger King breakfast. I'm so excited. I haven't had Burger King breakfast in a while. When was the last time you had it? <laughs> That's forever ago. Never. So I got a croissant sandwich with ham, which I'm going to be taking out because I don't really like ham. She got bacon in her, so it's egg, cheese, bacon on a croissant. We got some hash browns to share, and then we have French toast sticks because I had that on the menu, and I was like, wow, that would be really good. So that's what we have for you guys today. And I think we're just gonna be talking about in this video our favorite movies because we did a video that was talking about our favorite TV shows. So now we wanna talk about our favorite movies because why not? Why guys? not? Why not? We never really talked about that before, and that's like a part of who we are, I guess. I but love like, movies. I like movies. I like them a lot. It's just sometimes they're just so long, and like my attention span sometimes is just not the best. So, you know. But you want to start off with what movies are your favorite? It's mm -hmm. like, it's almost like when you're talking about your favorite movies, you almost need to go like per category mm -hmm. because it's like some movies don't even, on the grand scale, they're not the same as like others. Like you wouldn't really put Titanic with Frozen. Like, mm -hmm. you know, they're just like, they're different. But I think if there's a movie that I love, not that I could watch it every day, because it's not really that kind of movie, but Tombstone, if anybody knows what that is, it's not everybody, it's not like this generation's kind of movie necessarily. It was, I don't even know what it was made in the 90s, I think. But but it's like there's just that whole movie is a western kind of thing and there there's so many lines in it that are just so classic and the writing is amazing the acting i love the acting i love the actors in it um but i love tombstone it's my favorite okay i have to say it's hard to pick like an all-time favorite right i have so many movies that i love but it's hard to like pinpoint one specific one to be like that's my movie you know i think my favorite movie of all time would have to be The Devil Wears Prada. It is so good, it's timeless. I love that movie so much. It always puts me in a good mood. Even if I'm in a super bad mood, if I watch that movie, like it'll lift my spirits for sure. Love that movie so much. I've still never even seen it. I've never seen Tombstone. We should watch each other's favorite. We should, what a good idea. We'll probably do that after this video. That sounds cool. But yeah, Devil Wears Prada, love that movie. I also really love a lot of Disney movies. I'm really into Disney. So I like Frozen. I love The Parent Trap. That's also timeless. The 1998 one, not the like oh, yeah. 1960. I still never love seen that Parent one. Trap. But yeah, I've always loved Parent Trap. That's always been one of my favorites. I also love really Happy good. Death Day. Isn't it really good? I love Happy Death Day. I know it got a bad rap online, but <laughs> it's a pretty good movie. I'm trying to think of what else. The Pirates of the Caribbean, like I hate those whole movies. series. My favorite. I hate those movies. Like, Why? There are so many movies that everybody's like obsessed with and I, I literally can't stand to watch. Like Star Wars. Can't. Yeah, thank you. You know what other movie I love? You know this. I love Wish Upon a Star. It was like made in 1996. It's a Disney movie. I love that movie so much. I've probably watched it a thousand times. I have it like three copies of it on DVD because I just... I don't want to ever lose access to that DVD or like that movie. It's also on YouTube, but you never know with copyright. So I, you know, I got a backup plan. I know we weren't like big Twilight fans. <sighs> Everybody was obsessed with Twilight. I could never watch Twilight. I could never do yeah. it. I didn't hate them. Like some people's like you either hated it or you like loved it. And it seems like people hated it just to kind of hate it to be popular and trendy. You know what I really, I cannot stand, and I know you can't stand either, Harry Potter, Harry Potter series. Why? Why do people like Harry Potter? I tried and people tried and love tried. Harry Potter. Obsessed. People are obsessed. And I just don't get it. I literally have no idea why Harry Potter is so popular. So I like the cinematography and like the graphics. Like I could see that aspect of it being very popular as far as that goes, but I've only seen bits and pieces because I cannot, I just can't watch the whole thing through. I can't. You know, it's a guilty pleasure one. Uh, the scary movie franchise. Scary movie one, two with the, oh. with the Wyan brothers. I'm 90% sure it's Wyan and not Wyan. I think you're right, but let us know in the comments if we're let wrong. Please. Cause I, I used to, like their show used to be one of my favorite shows for a long time too. But yeah, no, those scary movies are so dumb. White chicks. Timeless. Favorite. Timeless movie. Her mom took us 
to no, I think our moms took us to see it when we were ten. I think it came so. out in the theaters. Yeah, and we would like play it every sleepover. Like we would. It was a must. <sighs> we would Such quote the movie. movie like all the time all on the, the playground. Time. Yes, mm-hmm. all the time. I still quote the movie like more yes. than I probably should. I don't think I'll stop <laughs> ever. She can't be stopped. Again. I can't be stopped. Um, and they were going to do a second one, weren't they? I don't know if they ever made it yet. I feel like that was rumor. I don't know if it was true or not, but I feel like it was going around that they, they were going to. So, they show it on that. that. They should. I feel they like I'd be upset. More than 10 years later than that. Mm. Yeah, I like that one. I like, yeah, I like scary movies. And I really like comedy movies. I'm not big into action movies. You guys want a third of a burrito? No, okay. we're stuck. Sure. We're stuck. Okay, cool. okay cool. Thank you. Yeah. Keep that in there. <laughs> Things mean kindness. Um, no, but I really don't care for action movies or adventure. I'm not very into those kind of movies. I mm-hmm. like laughing or being scared. Yeah, romance yeah. movies are. I kind of like some of them, but like The Notebook for me, like ones like that where I'm, I cannot help but cry is like. I don't know. I can't handle those movies that much anymore. Like, my heart. You know what I mean? The Notebook is, like, I feel like it's a rite of passage to put your significant other through watching it. Yes. Like, just, like, yeah. for torture. Yeah. <laughs> but the Basically. movie itself, like, the ending is so... Your heart. Like, literally... It doesn't make me feel good about anything in life. No, so I choose no. to not watch it. Other yeah. than that, I'd probably, I'd probably really like that movie. And, like, the yeah. Titanic. Titanic, <sighs> yeah. that ending just makes me sad. I don't... So sad. Right? So I don't watch it. Yeah. Or there was only, I think, two other movies that legitimately made me, like, cry, cry. It was Bicentennial Man with Robin Williams. That one at the end. Oh, my I gosh. Like, seen it. even Josh was crying at the end. Josh never cries over anything. Are you serious? I, I have only, to watch this movie. Yeah. Bicentennial Man. Like, makes you think about life in such a different light. Like, it, it's just... It's such a good movie, but it is like, gosh, like it jerks at your heart. It's crazy. Uh, so Bicentennial Man, About Time. That's the other one. About oh, Time. Goodness. I think that one, that one was made a couple years ago. About Time or uh, something like that. It was. I think it was past 2010. But yeah, that one definitely like, oh my gosh. Coco got me a little choked up in the movie theater <laughs> at the <laughs> end. I still never watched Coco. When I was on the a plane not too long ago. Coco was on there and I thought about you and I was like, should I watch Coco? And guess what I watched? The Devil Wears Prada. Prada. Yeah. <laughs> and I watched The Parent Trap instead. So, yeah. I, sh- I should literally make her watch it today. <laughs> it's just the ending of Coco reminds me of my grandma and like that just hits home. Still a happy ending. Yeah. It doesn't make you feel like the world is over. Like Titanic. <laughs> yeah. Or Marley and me. I, I don't never get it. That I don't get it. Daniel, <laughs> he made me watch that movie because he was like, it's such a good movie. It's so good. No, he made me watch Marley and Me mm-hmm. and it got right to the saddest point. And I look over and this, this man is asleep. He is slumped Stop. over and I'm just there like, <laughs> why? He needs to support trash. you. Trash, Daniel. And I hated the movie. I literally hated the movie at the end. I was like, oh no. You know what's another movie? So stupid to admit to. This movie literally made me cry. Um, Fox is out. <laughs> no, you have a point. <laughs> you have a point. The Fox is out. I lied. That was another movie I'm going to read. I saw it for the first time because we got Disney Plus. He said, you have to watch this movie. This is an all-time oh, so this is child. Yeah, this is an all-time childhood favorite. And I yeah. said, all right, babe, I'll give it a shot. Because in the movie, I'm just going to say it. If you haven't seen it, then... Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. So the grandma lady <laughs> takes this... She takes the fox that she's been raising from baby foxhood... And because he's too much trouble, he loves her, like, so much. Let me just say that he loves her so much. And he, but he's trouble. And she gets them all bundled up. Takes oh, that was at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. No, it's, 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 it was it's like the end. Middle, middle towards the end of the movie. Really? I thought that's how the movie started. I haven't seen the movie in No, years, the movie started her finding a baby fox. Oh, okay, that's what I thought you were talking about. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 she yeah, finds yeah, the baby right, fox. Right. Mm-hmm. 
But he's too much trouble. Yeah. And she's worried he's going to get himself into even bigger trouble. So she thinks she's doing the right thing by taking him for a ride, okay? And first off, he was so excited to be in the car and just be with her. (laughs) And then she just (laughs) drops him off in the middle of the forest where he's never been before. He wasn't raised in the forest. He doesn't know what's going to happen. He wasn't trained to be in the forest. That'd be like dropping us off in the forest. Like, yeah. Like, you're worried about us getting hurt, so you drop us off in the forest. That is far more dangerous (laughs) to a civilian fox. And I'm looking at Daniel like, (laughs) this isn't going to happen. She's not going to drop off this fox. She is not about to drop off this fox. And he's like looking at me because he knows I'm getting angry. And then I was like, okay, he wouldn't put this on if that's what's going to happen. And then it happened. She drops him off. And I looked at him. I said, why would you do that? Like, why? Like, I really want to know. Why did you find it necessary to show me this? Like, I got so pressed. And I went out to my parents. And I said, now I know why I've never seen that movie. (laughs) And my mom said, now you know. That's why I didn't want to show it to you. You wouldn't like it. And I said, that was the worst movie I've ever seen in my life. Worst? No. I hate that movie. I hate it. He... Then he's like a socially awkward fox. Like he's not even like, he like tries to go out on dates and, or on a date and he's just like socially awkward and he's kind of a jerk. Yeah. We watch Shrek. I want to watch Shrek. Can I be real with you? <clears throat> Confession time, everybody. <laughs> I never really liked Shrek. You heard it here, folks. You heard it here first. I never really liked Shrek. Oh my god, it feels great to say that. I don't like Shrek. I don't like it. I think it's odd. I don't like the swamp monster, Shrek. I don't like him. Fiona, don't like her. The donkey, he bothers me a lot. A lot. Why does donkey bother you? He's so... Just like out there, and he thinks he's funny. He is AF. funny. Some people may think he's funny. Others may think that he's odd. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Some you know, people think we're funny, and some, some people, people think, think we're odd. Yeah, but um, no, I don't. I don't have enough trucks. Tell me. I will. You're gonna take me in the back over there, and I'll drop you off in the middle of the forest. So, if you guys never see me back on this channel, you heard it here first, folks. I'll be in the forest. Snacks and snacks. (laughs) Snacks and more snacks. But, um, yeah, Yeah. so those were movies. That really got my adrenaline going. I know, right? Like, and it really got me thinking. Like, critical thinking skills. Critical critical development happening. Mm -hmm. We don't ever critically think about anything. So, for that to happen crazy yeah but yeah we're pretty much done with this breakfast right now because pretty full you guys know the drill you guys have been on this channel probably long it's also enough to very know. early can we just say that like yeah look at my little eyes <laughs> <laughs> if you like what you're seeing here go ahead and like comment subscribe whatever you feel like doing and we will catch you guys in the next video bye, bye.